You may outgrow writing letters to Santa Claus. You may outgrow getting dresses, popularly known as clothes, known as Christmas clothes. You may outgrow all of these, but nobody really outgrows getting something nice as part of their Christmas gift. In fact, many people still have a Christmas wish list. So if I asked you, what is on your Christmas wish list, what would you say? Now today we're heading into the streets of Lagos, Nigeria to ask a few people what's on their Christmas wish list. Just so we're clear, if you're watching and you're asking what's on mine, money, money, money. Thank you and God bless. <laughs> All right, so just to add a little spice to the package, we just might be sharing with you a few tips on how you can get gifts for your loved ones during this festive season. Enjoy. It's that time of the year when we marry, gather, share joy, laughter, exchange gifts and compliments with family, friends and colleagues. Christmas is an annual festival commemorating the birth of Jesus Christ, observed on the 25th of December every year as a religious and cultural celebration amongst billions of people around the world. Generally, Christmas is seen as um, Christ's birthday, Jesus' birthday. A Christmas celebration, celebration of the birth of Christ. You know. To us Christians, in remembrance of um, Jesus Christ, and some of us just, we just think, okay, we are Christmas, but we forget the meaning of Christmas. So I feel during Christmas, and it's a time for everybody to remember that, yes, there's a lot more to Christianity, to being a Christian. Do you get? Christmas means uh, the opportunity to spend time with family and friends, loved ones generally. Uh, like you said, it's a festive season, so it's just time to relax and get away from the stress of, of Nigeria, generally. <laughs> it's something that is very, very, you know, not new anyway, that has been happening, that anybody, even a, a small child, can answer. It means love and associating yourself with family and friends you have not seen for a while. I don't say it means love and get together, unity. Remembering Christ our Savior, the day he was born. It means a lot, like um, you get to meet your loved ones, you know, visit people, less privileged, you know, people around you, their loved ones, the ones you left long time ago, you know. Uh, Christmas, basically, festive period where people come together, I don't know, yeah, family, non-family, it's just the celebration, the joy, and then, um, of course, the birth of Jesus Christ. Like they said, celebration of the birth of uh, our Lord Jesus Christ. So that is why we are celebrating the birth of Jesus, that Jesus Christ was born. Christmas is just like an avenue for we Christians to have time for the less privileged mothers, women, homes, and our families. It means the coming of Jesus Christ, the birth of Jesus Christ, him coming to the world, and we celebrating his birth, yes. I don't know, most people have their own meanings to what Christmas means. Rice, cooking, chicken, frying of chicken, then visiting places, interesting places with the kids. It means celebrating the birth of Jesus Christ, um, the celebration of Christmas actually means the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ and uh, that's when he is born even though we don't actually know the actual date but that's the point in time that Christians come together to celebrate his birth. It means love, it means sharing, happiness, meeting the less privileged. That is what Christmas means, total enjoyment. That is what it means to me, celebration in galore. This Christmas may be different in more ways than one for many Nigerians due to the current economic situation in the country, as many hopes of receiving and giving gifts may not materialize. But we all do really still want something for Christmas this year. A whole lot of things. I desire for a lot of things, but I think I'll just keep that personal. Yeah. What I want is plenty, but I think basically what I think I need now is just uh, divine love and support from God and, you know, as they say, with God all things are possible. Wow. Actually, let me say, iPhone X Max. <laughs> Mm, what would I want for Christmas? Really nothing. I think um, just be with my family is enough for Christmas. That's the best gift ever. Hey, is there anything I want? Oh, above all, I want good health. Life. What do I want? Hmm, my list is long. <laughs> well, hmm. Thank God, finally, somebody asked me. I want a new phone. <laughs> a new phone, yes, now. That's all, a new phone. Okay, um, it's personal. <laughs> okay, what I want for Christmas is... Nothing, only what I want is just safety and... Uh... <laughs> Honestly, 
I want to leave Nigeria. <laughs> <laughs> All I want is money. Because with money, I can get anything I want. So if there's money, I can get everything. <laughs> what do I want for Christmas? Hmm. One thing, I've been mentioned many things. I want to have fun. All round fun. Eh? To cruise, you know? In fact, anyway, I can have fun with my family, my husband, my children. Then I'll have fun. And in fact, that was that would be what would keep me moving. That is without happiness. You can't you can't make it. You can't be, you know, you'll be the depression depression will come in. Um what I want for Christmas actually is just um everything my kids want. Because uh, they are what matter to me, you know, so anything they want, if I can afford it, then it makes my Christmas fine. I wish someone could get me a car for Christmas. <laughs> yes, so that's what I want for Christmas. My Christmas gift will be, wow, okay, just a call from an old friend who will do. But basically, oh, I, I just want to record this, yeah. Mm, actually, it means. <laughs> Then, additional to that one, maybe a brand new car. <laughs> a brand new car. I can go on and on and on. Nigeria that we are today, I also want so many things to be improved. That's the ordinary Nigerian on the streets speaking on Christmas. So we met up with a professional in the arts or Christmas packaging, events, decorations, and gifts. So we are professional Christmas decorators, and then we also put gifts together for anyone, everyone, for any occasion, for adults, children. So really, yes, we are professional Christmas decorators, and then we own a, a gift company as well. We started off decorating houses five years ago, and... I just liked it. I just liked it. And then I went, I went for a proper training, came back and started decorating for a living. So for the gift side of it, you don't really know. I guess it's just being able to tell what people want. So I use myself for an example. So what would I want on my birthday? I would want balloons. I would want cards. I would want money. I would want a perfume. I would want, so I don't know, so I think when I'm buying stuff or when I'm thinking gifts, I put myself into it. So I just use people around me to, to get gifts. I, I use my family, they're my meals, I think. So I think of what they would like, what my sister would like, what my mom would like, what my father would like, and then that helps me to get gifts. For the Christmas side of it, um, I guess, I, I wouldn't lie, I would say Pinterest has really helped. I look at pictures, I watch videos on YouTube, see how they put the lights around, see everything, and I guess it just happens. You don't really know when you're good at something. I guess you just keep doing it one day after the other, and then you find out that, okay, this is my thing, I can actually do this. So what's the perfect gift for a Nigerian with the current state of the economy? After you men mentioned recession, I would have gone all out, but now that you've just men mentioned recession, let me be fair. Okay, for a guy, maybe a Christmas, an ideal Christmas gift, maybe be a bottle of wine, a pack of stockings, a grooming kit, belts, socks, a bottle of perfume would be ideal. For the ladies, Honestly, because I'm decorating, like I decorate from like 1st of November to December 22nd, what I would really want for Christmas is some time away. So maybe a ticket to a nice place. But I think an ideal gift for a lady would be some nice weave, I guess, from a nice place. Guy, girls like to look nice. So get them a nice wig or weave, um, a bottle of perfume. We like money too, so if you give us maybe wrap up some dollars, pounds, naira, put a ribbon in it and just give it to the girl, trust me, like we're happy. Cause then we use that, cause the thing, what I realized is the guys don't really know what we want. Now that we know what the men and women of Nigeria want this Christmas, what would the perfect hamper combination this holiday? Perfect combination for a hamper. Wine, cake, biscuits, candle, diffuser, yeah, that's okay, that should do, anyone should like that. And a card, a Christmas card. Bumi just wants us to be thankful and merry this Christmas season. I feel like when it's when we're getting to the end of the year, we start to feel bad and start to think of the things we haven't achieved. So I would advise anyone to just be like me and just be thankful, thankful for life, thankful for your family members because a lot of people have actually lost their lives this year. So I guess I would advise everyone to just chill out we still have many years to achieve all these beautiful things we're thinking of and let's just be thankful to god for the business point of from the business point of view come and buy plenty things buy ampers buy christmas trees buy food buy gifts christmas may be a christian holiday 
but it's time to show and receive love, care for the less privileged, be grateful, joyful, and make the world a far better place than we met it. So from all of us at Hello Nigeria, have yourself a Merry Merry Christmas. To enjoy more of these our Ogunge videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.